What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, where we are digging. Uh, we don't have any power. I think I need to raise the priority of this. I'm actually going to raise the priority of these all together. Um, that way, people will try to get these done first before, you know, going out and doing other things. Because it's important to get the science and all that done. Uh, let's see here. I already did all that. Grungy fell asleep. Hmm. Iron ore. Never had iron before. Yeah, what we really need to do is get those algae Algae terrariums, that's what they're called. Put a couple down here. Just to take care of the uh, the CO2 that's starting to build up. I mean, we're good for now, but still. It's going to be an issue eventually. Might as well get to it now. Hmm. We have a lot of oxygen. I'm considering turning this off. Just to kind of save on algae for now. And then later on we'll make more oxygen if we need it. I wish there was like a threshold I could set on this. Like the... Like the power generation. Be like, if it's below 300 grams of oxygen per tile or whatever, turn on. Hmm. Looks like Grungy's working on that. We completed our research. So the first thing we want to do is we want to put... Well, actually, we don't want to put it on the uh, edge there, do we? I think we're going to put one here and one here, and that's hopefully going to take care of the CO2 that's building up. I don't think it's going to be enough to produce all the oxygen that we need, though. So I'm going to keep this guy around. Other things we can do is we can set up a planter box. Mm. Yeah. I found the problem with my design. Put the food over here because the water. I feel like I need to move the cots up. I might do that. I think that's worthwhile. That way... We can put a couple planters around. I, call, I also want to move this ration box, because it just isn't really necessary. We'll leave one cot down here for Josie, and then the other three can go up there. I don't actually need that many. Mm, ladder? Looks like we got our algae terrariums going. Let's see. Let's say how much... Hmm. Okay. Let's see here. On the tooltip... It just says it's emitting oxygen. It doesn't say how much CO2 it's bringing in, though. I think that's in here. Yeah. Takes in a lot of CO2 doesn't release that much oxygen but at least it'll take care of our co2 issues uh yeah next thing we want to research hmm Could go for percolation and sanitation or i think power is actually going to be the most important thing Getting something like a coal generator early on, since we only have four colonists and I don't really plan on expanding anytime soon. I think that's that's actually a really good idea. Okay. Yeah, we selected that. Hmm. 
Oh, there's no applicable research, that's why. I was trying to get it to... Trying to set up this thing for the supercomputer, but because we're still doing a level 1 research, it doesn't let me. We have insufficient oxygen generation, yeah, I'm aware. This is all barely breathable out here. I think what I'm gonna do... I don't have the doorway. I really need the... The airlock door. Okay. We can go ahead and deconstruct these. Deconstruct that one. And then this one is going to be Josie's. The other three colonists will get these. And then we want to go... Wait a minute. Oh, that's right. Compost. We'll put a compost down there. Um, we want planter boxes. So I'm going to put as many as I can on this level, and then I'm going to put those there. And I think we dug up some plants, but I'm not sure. In fact, can I see that somewhere? Edible, maybe? No. Hmm. Maybe I can't see the seeds that I have? No, I have zero seeds. Okay. So we need to get... Some mealwood seeds. Yeah, we have zero. Where is some mealwood? I think this is the only mealwood around. I guess we'll dig into that. And dig that. I guess we can dig those too. Why not? Yeah, we actually don't have very much mealwood around. Usually it's not a problem, but in this start, it's very rare. Oh well, it's not a big deal. Looks like Josie's delivering dirt to the science, which is fine. Uh, we have some contaminated dirt. Looks like we're running out of oxygen. I'm going to turn this back on. Yeah, it's unbreathable in most areas right now. Well, hopefully we can fix that with the deoxidizer on now. Yeah, it's all dark blue. Not very good. Better than nothing, though. There's a lot of oxygen in there. I really want to break this open, actually. Let's get that open as quick as possible. Yeah, look at that. All that oxygen rushing in. It's very nice. Uh, I'm not sure what they're doing down here. It's fine. Let's see. Did they dig up the mealwood? No. Hopefully someone will dig it up soon. We also probably want to build a massage table. It looks like people are starting to get a little stressed out. So I'm going to put one down so that we can kind of start to manage that. Like Rowan right now could really use a massage. Just to relax a bit. Let's go ahead and plant one of those there. I feel like this other one requires a temperature that we don't have. I feel like it either needs to be warm or cold and I don't remember which one. I can try planting it though and see what happens. But I'm pretty sure the temperature isn't right. Looks like they got this going, which is good. We're gonna make that a higher priority than standard orders. I 
We can start making that research, which is good. And yeah, see, it's stifled. Where'd it go? Mm, probably nobody that I want. There's a diver's lung guy. Those are pretty nice, the uh, lowered air consumption. But I don't see anyone particularly amazing. I'm just going to reject them. Keep the colony nice and small. It looks like the bristle blossom is growing. Interesting. What else do we have? There's a mealwood up there. Hmm. You know, a bunch of vacuums, though. Hmm. I think for now we just want to continue our research. We did get the battery, which I kind of want to replace this with. I'm going to wait till they go to sleep though, so the battery gets fully drained before. Or as drained as it'll become, at least. I don't know if it'll fully drain. And this is going to be an 8. I can make it. Looks like ox oxygen is pretty good. Let's go ahead and disable that. Oh, Grungy fell asleep. Darn narco narcoleptics. Just straight up ate the muck root. Yeah, hopefully this will grow well. And we'll get some seeds out of it. Mm, Rowan's still got diarrhea, huh? Yeah, he's a stinky guy. Well, it's a good thing that he's just right here. Hmm. A lot of dirt up there. I think right now we're just going to try and get as much research done as possible. Once I get the, uh... Oh, yeah. Once I get the coal power plant, I think I'm going to build one down here. But for now... I mean, I suppose I can draw the ladder down. But yeah, for now there's not very much we can do. Once we get the coal, we'll at least be able to free up Elvis a little bit. And then we'll continue researching, trying to get to a place where we can start to be more sustainable. Right now I'm mostly worried about algae consumption. I'd like to lower that as much as possible because that's generally where people run into issues. Hmm. Just looking around at the materials. A lot of granite, obsidian, igneous rock. Some bisolite stuff is freezing. I wonder if water can freeze. I've seen people boil it. People have been doing this weird thing with batteries where they can boil water. Um, let's see, where's my battery? Yeah, see how it's 126 degrees Celsius? So if you put a little water on there, it'll boil and turn into steam, but I don't know if you can freeze the water. Be nice to get some air purifiers down here eventually. 
also want to dig that whole area out. My biggest concern right now is if I do the coal power plant, I'm going to run into CO2 issues. And I don't really have a way to handle that at the moment. So I may hold off on it. Until we get the scrubber. Well, the scrubber's are real far out, though. Mm. I'm not sure. We definitely want sanitation services. I think we're going to go sanitation, and then we're going to go all the way out to advanced filtration. And then probably med bay? What's this? Insulated tile. Because we want these mesh tiles. I'd like for all the gases and things to settle where they settle. So I can have something like... It'll be a gradient, right? And there'll be... <clears throat> up at the top will be the light things like hydrogen and uh, oxygen. I don't know how heavy chlorine is. Flammable. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't... It doesn't say how heavy a molecule is. But I'm assuming that the hydrogen will go at the top because hydrogen is very light. And then there will probably be oxygen and or chlorine. So those two will probably sit somewhere in the middle. And then like CO2 and then like liquids at the very bottom. That way we can have, you know, like a gradient of everything that we need. We'll have like a habitable area. We'll have like hydrogen power up at the top and we'll have like CO2 scrubbing down at the bottom and all that stuff. I don't know if there's anything useful you can do with with uh, chlorine yet. I feel like you should be able to use chlorine to sanitize. That would be pretty awesome. So you'd like pump in a bunch of uh, actually I don't see any. You'd be able to pump punch in a pump in a bunch of contaminated water it doesn't seem to exist on this map and then like use the chlorine and like turn it into purified water that'd be pretty awesome uh, what's going on here no research selected yeah let's go sanitation services I'd like to get out of the outhouses as quickly as possible Somebody leveled up. Rowan's a little bit better at tinkering. Since we have this, let's go ahead and put Rowan on the massage table for a bit. He's been getting stressed out. I think he's been having issues breathing over here. Oh, that's right. I want to make this like a 9. Like, Actually, let's make it an 8. Just so I can give emergency orders. But 99% of the time he's going to be sitting on that massage table. Until he's good enough to go, and then we'll put Elvis up there. Slowly digging this out. When we get that liquid pumping... Honestly, the way that this is already is pretty perfect for us. Like, we have almost a perfect little water tank. Yeah, I don't think I really need to do any pumping for a while. But eventually I'd like to pump all this water into this tank. Or this to-be tank. And yeah, they're having a lot of issues breathing down there. Let's go ahead and turn this back on. Try and get an excess of water, or excess of oxygen. Yeah, we're running low. I think I'm just going to leave it on. I mean, I don't have a lot of algae, but... Realistically, I'm going to end up using up all that oxygen. Like, we need it, and it's going to be a while before we get the research for better stuff. 
But that is time. So thanks everyone for watching and I will see you in the next one.